Today we're going to talk about inspection of the water mist system. Uh, PPE required for this will be your general PPE, hard hat, coverall, steel toed shoes. Normally you witness operational tests of that during new construction or modifications. The system is designed with sensors above the equipment protected. Uh, one of those will be a smoke detector, the other one will be infrared. Once that is triggered, we've got flow from a reserve tank through the booster pump, through the valve arrangement to the uh, appropriate equipment protected. Once it gets there, you get the hyper mist above the system. So the, we have solenoid valves equipped in the system here. So when the alarms come in, they're gonna force this valve open and allow water flow through. Well, we're on top of the auxiliary boiler. Right now, these are fuel lines that are gonna provide uh, fuel oil into the burners. If we had a fire up here due to a fuel leak, the smoke detectors would let them know. It would activate the system. The water mist would fire and allow, a, put a curtain over the, the fire and help smother it. The space is also protected by high pressure CO2. So during witnessing the operational test of the water mist system, we noticed that the sensors were activated and we got proper uh, spray over the protected equipment. So in summary, we talked about the inspection of the water mist system. We've talked about when you would witness an operational test of the system. We've talked about the system is fed from the emergency bus. We looked at the water level tank. We looked at the sensors and the alarms. We looked at the booster pumps. If you've got any additional questions, ask your local VO.